Hello, welcome to this tutorial, Geometric Construction. This is an introduction to Geometric Construction. In this video, we are going to learn how to construct angles. So first, construction of our angles. And our first problem, on a line segment AB equals 7 centimeters, Construct each of the following angles at A using a ruler and a pair of compasses only. Starting with A, we start with A, we draw a horizontal line, locate a, a point A, place your ruler, and uh, mark 7 centimeters there and uh, that is point B. We now open a convenient radius from our pair of compasses. We take A as center, draw an arc towards B. So we have an arc, still maintaining the same radius. Take this point as center, draw another arc to cut the existing arc. And the point of intersection of the two arcs is joined to A. So we join it. This angle here is 60 degrees. So the angle here is 60 degrees. We have done justice to question 1A. Now we go to B. So that's construction of angle 90 degrees. Also, you draw a line segment, a horizontal line, locate point A. That's A from your ruler. We mark out uh, 7, since AB is 7 centimeters. So we have a uh, point B. From point B, we open again a convenient radius, take A as center. This time around, we are going to construct a semicircle. So, construct semicircle with a convenient radius with a pair of compasses. We can increase our radius from now. You now take uh, this point as center, draw an arc above A. You draw an arc above A. Then now take this point again as center, draw another arc to cut the existing arc above A. Then we join the point of intersection of the two arcs to A. So this angle here is 90 degrees. This angle is 90 degrees. Now C. Construction of angle 120 degrees. And the same way, draw a horizontal line, mark a point, name it A, then place your ruler, mark 7 centimeters. So that is point B. Now open the convenient radius and uh, take A as center, draw an arc to the left of A, then still maintaining the same radius. Take this point as center, draw another arc, and uh, we now join the point of intersection of the two arcs to A. This angle here is 120 degrees. So with this, we have done justice to the first problem on construction of angles. Then our next subtopic is bisection of our angles. So here, on a line segment PQ, construct each of the following angles at P using a ruler and a pair of compasses only. So we start from A, construction of angle 30 degrees. Uh, the construction of angle 30 degrees is the bisection of angle 60 degrees. Bisection means dividing the angle into two. So we construct angle 60, then bisect it to get angle 30 degrees. So we draw our line segment. This is point P. Locate another point Q. 
it must not be so close. So we still give a reasonable distance. So we now take P as center. We want to construct angle 60 degree first. Constructing angle 60 degrees, we draw an arc opening a convenient radius with our pair of compasses. Take P, take P as center, draw an arc, then still maintaining the same radius, take this point as center, draw an arc, then join the point of intersection of the two arcs to P. This is angle 60 degrees, so we bisect to get 30 degrees. So here we go. We take this point as a center, opening a convenient radius. It can be more than line PQ. So draw an arc to the right. So take this point again at center, draw another arc. So we join the point of intersection of the two arcs to P. So we have bisected angle. 60 degrees to get this one to be 30 degrees. So by implication, this also is 30 degrees. Remember, the angle from this line up to this line PQ will give us 150 degrees. So I think with this, we have treated the construction of angle 30 degrees and 150 degrees. So the other angle, the opposite angle here, it is 150 degrees. Based on the concept of angles on a straight line is 180 degrees. So some of this angle and the other angle is 180. So 180 minus 30 gives 150 degrees. So this angle here is 150 degrees. B, construction of angle 45 degrees. Also, angle 45 degrees is the bisection of angle 90 degrees since 90 divided by 2 gives 45. So we go further to construct our, to draw, we start by drawing our line segment PQ. So locate P and uh, Q. Now we construct angle 90 degrees at P, then bisect it. To get 45 degrees. So open convenient radius, take P as center, construct a semicircle. Now take uh, this point as center, draw an arc above with reasonable radius. So still maintaining the same radius. Take this point as center, draw another arc to cut the first arc. Join their point of intersection to P. So this is angle 90 degrees. So we are going to bisect this uh, 90 degrees to get 45 degrees. So this is our point of reference for the bisection. So we take this point as center, opening a reasonable radius. You may still maintain the radius used here. Draw an arc to the right. Now take this point as center, draw another arc to this point and join their point of intersection to P. We have this, and uh, this angle here is 45 degrees. So still remember, the other angle will be 180 minus 45 degrees, and that will give us 135 degrees. 135 degrees, so we have used this, bisection to get 45 degrees and at the same time 135 degrees. Now construction of angle 15 degrees. So uh, 15 degrees is bisection of angle 30 degrees. Since 30 divided by 2 gives 15. So we construct angle 60 degrees first. Construct angle 60 degrees first. Now we still remember Take P as center, opening a convenient radius, draw an arc to cut PQ, maintaining the same radius. This is the point, the center, and uh, draw another arc, we join. This is 60, 
If I take the 60, so these are our point of reference for the bisection. Take this as center, draw another arc to the right. Take this as center again, draw another arc. And join their point of intersection to P. So this is the bisection of 60 to give us 30. We now bisect this 30 to give us 15 degrees. We still take these two points as our points of bisection. So we take this point as center, draw an arc. Take this as center, draw another arc to point. So their point of intersection is joined to P. And uh, this angle here is 15 degrees. I remember the angle from here to this place is 180 minus 15 that will give us 165 degrees now lastly the construction of angle 22.5 degrees so 45 divided by 2 gives 22.5 degrees so we shall construct angle 90 degrees bisect it to get 45 degrees bisect 45 degrees to get 22.5 degrees so here we go, our line segment P and Q. So here we take P as center, opening a convenient radius, draw a semicircle, then opening, increasing your radius for convenience, take this point as center, construct an uh, arc above P, Take this point as center, construct an under arc above P. Join the point of intersection to P. Now we bisect this angle 90 degrees. Take this point as center, draw an arc to the right. This point as center, draw an arc to cut the first arc. Join the point of intersection to P. We have this to be 45 degrees. So we are going to bisect 45 degrees. So by taking 45 degrees to get 22.5, we take this point as uh, a center, take it as center, draw an arc to the right, take this point as center, draw another arc to the right, join the point of intersection to P. So this is 22.5 degrees. So you can calculate the other angle. And uh, we are going to have 157.5 degrees at the other angle. The other angle, 45 degrees. This is the end of solution to the second problem. We have more angles, like angle 105 degrees, 75 degrees, 7.5 degrees, so on. So please subscribe to our channel, Putting Out Resources on YouTube for more on geometric construction. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.